Today we're doing a comparison between a Hacker RF1 and a SDR Play RSP2 at uh, Citizens Band's frequencies using SDR GLUT to capture and play back the signals. And so here we're going to play back the signals that I captured and we'll do the first location which is about three miles away behind a 1200 foot mountain here. And so we'll uh, unmute it. Okay, that was a little bit weak, but you could still clearly hear it. And we'll do the uh, SDR play now. And again, it was... Uh, a little bit weak but clear and so that was the first location. The second location is about a quarter mile down the hill into the canyon and so we'll do it. Now here's the Hacker RF-1 And you could hear just a little bit quieting and you could hear the 10 at the end. I typically do 10 extra loud. And so here's the uh, SDR play at the same location. And again, it was it was quite weak, but you could just barely make out the 10 at the end. And now we'll go to the last location. Which is uh, 200 yards up from where this, the last one was. And, uh, okay, so we'll do the Hacker RF. And you could hear that quite clearly. And so now we'll do the SDR play. And so um, basically the Hacker RF-1 and the SDR Play were almost indistinguishable. The SDR Play may have been just a tiny, tiny bit, but we'll just have to call it a tie.